Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you wanted to help support this channel, it won't cost you anything. All you got to do is use the links in the description if you wanted to get one of these for yourself. Hey, what's going on, Rich? Back with another awesome video for you. Just picked up a Fantex Halos Lux Digital RGB frame, and it is a metal frame that goes around your fan. And what it does is it provides RGB lighting to make kind of a ring effect in front of the fan. Here is my PC. I gotta get this cleaned up. I'm just finishing up building it. We're gonna see if this syncs with the Aura on the ASUS software. Let me get this out of the box and I'll show you what it looks like and we'll go from there. Basically what you're getting here is the LED frame itself. You have four screws, so we could screw the fan right in that way if you want. And of course you have your wiring. So frame's not that big itself. There's the frame, that's what it looks like. It's not that big. So the cord itself is about 20 inches. This is what it looks like. It's got the clip on the end, so you could daisy chain it into more LEDs or more fan covers, whatever you wanna do. Uh, it also comes with an extension right here. Well, this looks like it's about a 20 inches also. The other thing too is shut your PC down and turn off the power switch in the back just so it doesn't have any power going through it. And you could actually unplug the plug that goes into the power supply just to be double, triple sure that you're not getting any power inside the PC itself. Here is the frame installed, and honestly, it looks absolutely incredible inside of this black PC. It looks really great with the rest of the case. I ran it into the top right side of the case, and now I'm gonna have to take the right panel off and then run it back through this grommet from the back and then hook it up into the case, which is right there where the white fan header is. This bundle of wires right here, which is the gray one, I ran this in through the grommet and that's plugged into the LED header on the motherboard. So this is the wire that came from the LED frame, which is in the braided wire right here, the black. And as you can see, all you do is plug it into this gray extension. So I have the case completely put back together and I'm gonna show you what this looks like. So there is the Fantex light in the back. Really cool RGB effects going on. Looks even better with the fan, the way it's spinning up. You can see the blades. Uh, there is the motherboard in the back. It's gonna sync to the video card. There it is. Nope, there we go, wait. And there it is. Okay, so as you can see, the video card and the motherboard, oh wow, the fan's already synced. I don't even have to do anything. Yeah, so all you gotta do, make sure you get the ASUS software and the fan is synced to the motherboard. And this thing is bright, let me tell you. Uh, it's lighting up the whole back wall. It looks really amazing. Uh, this is like the finishing touch. This is perfect. This is a mini ITX case. It's not a very big case at all, but there is what it looks like. It looks incredible. I am loving this. Looking really sweet. And again, the, uh, the video can't really do it justice. I mean, the colors just look absolutely amazing in real life. I can go into the ASUS Aura settings and change it like static. We can make it like blue. There's green, there is red, the color cycle, which just goes from one color to the next. Uh, rainbow, which is my favorite. I'm liking this one the best. So it basically goes from the top of the motherboard down, and then it goes through the video card, and then it circles around the fan, which is really cool. I'm loving this. Look at the fan, how it goes. Like you can see the red go around, now it's purple, now it's green, the blue. You could take any fan. I have the Noctua fan. I happen to be the biggest fan in the world of Noctua fans. They are the best. They're the quietest. They are the best performing. And as you could see, you could take a Noctua fan, which is plain and simple, no RGB lighting or anything, put this frame on the fan, and then now all of a sudden you have a Noctua fan with RGB lighting. And it is just too cool. Again, I really hope you like this video. I hope it helped you out. If you wanted to pick up one of these for yourself, I'm going to leave some links down in the description. And if you can, make sure to click that like button, subscribe to my channel for more awesome content, and let me know if you have any questions or comments in the section down below. Thank you so much for watching. Take care.